we have beam A, B. second beam is C, D and E. We have one support at A, we have one support at B, we have one support at E. It means you have to find out AY, you have to find out BY and you have to find out for this portion, I will only take this part. I will take this portion as well as this portion, which was connected by H and C. Method is clear. Pehle simple wala finish kar lenge. What is this reaction is RE. Well made by this one. 60. How many components of this RE? Two components. One is this component and one is this component. This component is RE sin 60. This one is RE cos 60. Now when you have to find out EY, my EY, EY, it will be EY or it will be right now, I will call this as RE sin 60. Actually, I want to find out RE sin 60. Only vertical component at one time. So right now, consider this portion. This point equals to what? D. This point equals to what? E. I will call this one is 2 meter. When you want to find out, you are thinking that where should I rotate? So rotation is only permit about what? Inch. And in this case, there is no question. When you have to find out AY, you have to rotate about B. And for BY, you have to rotate about A. So where is inch? Inch at C. And is the both forces are active or only you have to find out first EY? So I will show only EY component. Force and rotation is permit about this point so is this part will go like this upward and E will also go upward so what is del theta del theta is del T divided by 2 del E divided by 4 once you finish this then show external force we have external force at C but we don't have any displacement so I will just show the force on D point that equals to 4 kilo newton. Apply principle of virtual work. 4 minus del D because it's a opposite combination and RE sine 60 into del E is positive combination. Replace this value 4 into del 2 theta plus RE into sine 60 into del E, del E is 4 del theta, del theta is cancelled, solve for RE, ok right, to find AY, to find AY, consider entire beam, so this time I am drawing full scale, so I enlarge karke bata ra, enlarge karke, but you consider full beam or you have to only first consider AC part, First you only consider AC part. So show point A. Show. Now go to the problem definition first. You have defined the problem very carefully. When you want to find out AY. When you want to find out AY. The rotation is permitted about what? B. Now identify B. B is in middle. If it is middle. Then half portion will go up. And half portion will go down like this. But uh, what about this one? It's a UDL. So we have to find out one more load here for UDL. Where is this load? This is 6. I have to define one more point E. I have to define one point here is F. So this load is what? 6. I have to define one more point here. Figure is corrected. I have to define one extra point is F. What is this distance? Is UDL will act exactly halfway. UDL will act exactly halfway. 1.5 and 1.5. Remaining is 2. So, UDL is del theta. Let's call this one is del theta. Define del theta first. Del theta equals to del A divided by 
थ्री डेल एफ डिवाइडेड बाय एंड डेल सी डिवाइडेड बाय नाउ फॉर रिमेनिंग पोर्शन यू स्टार्ट बाय ड्राइंग हॉरिजॉन्टल लाइन Mark your point C D E. Now check to the problem definition. Your problem definition is that rotation about what E. Correct. It means that this part C has already come downward, but was rotated about which point E point. and therefore you have to connect like this if it was been at d then it has gone this way if it was been d but is right now e so it will be appear like this we have one value equals to delta d here so i will show one value delta d this distance is 2 meter and this distance is 2 meter and this angle i will call as del phi naturally del phi is different than del theta this value equals to del d and this is same as del c now what is del phi del phi equals to del d divided by del d divided by 2 and del c divided by This point. Now see this triangle. Is del C is common to both. So del C appear here also, and del C appear here also. What is del C from this? Is two times del theta. And what is del C from this side? Four times del theta. So is del phi is point five of del theta. One by one, we'll start show the forces. Let apply the principle of virtual work. A Y into D A is positive. Minus six into del F. This phi U and delta C, they are positive combination because they are acting in the same direction. This four, four. Into del d. Replace them. A y into three times del theta. Del f is one point five del theta plus five times del c is two times del theta plus four times del d. Del d was defined in terms of del phi. Is zero. So del phi is point phi of del theta. Yes, you will get a y. All right. To find to find b y, consider entire beam. Find out b y. So show b y. No problem. When you have to find out b y, rotation is permitted about a. So rotate this. Since your support is at one end. Your entire beam will go upward. So delta, this point is additional is del F, del B, and this one is del C. It call this one is del theta. So what is del theta? Del F divided by one point five. Del B divided by three. Del C divided by five. You draw first by dotted line. Now see the definition of problem. Where is support for second part at E? So rotation is permitted about E. But C already has moved upward, so it means that it will go like this. D will go upward. Del phi. This one is del D. 
डेल फाइ इज डिफाइंड एज डेल डी डिवाइड बाय टू डेल सी डिवाइडेड बाय फोर साइड्स डेल सी इज कॉमन टू फोर सो व्हाट इज डेल सी फ्रॉम दिस साइड डेल सी फ्रॉम दिस साइड इज व्हाट फाइव टाइम्स डेल थीटा फ्रॉम दिस साइड इज व्हाट फोर बाय फोर इनटू डेल फाइ फॉरगेट अबाउट डेल सी सॉल्व फॉर डेल फाइ is del phi is 5 by 4 5 by 4 is 1.25 of del theta so we have developed successfully relation between del phi and del theta last one show the external forces one force is 6 now apply principle of virtual work this and this they are acting in opposite direction so minus value this and this they are acting in same direction so positive value this and this they are acting in opposite direction so negative value this and this are acting in opposite direction so negative value minus 6 del f is 1.5 of del theta plus by del v is 3 times minus 5 times 5 times del theta minus 4 times what is del d del d is 2 times into del phi and what is del phi 1.25 of del theta solve this for b1 kal ki sum bataiye check vertical sum 